that kicked off my entrepreneurial journey. I was actually at university and I was teaching design programs, so things like Photoshop and InDesign. And students would take six months just to learn the very basics of where the buttons were, let alone actually how to design. And that was so complex and difficult to use. It became very apparent that in the future, everything was going to be online and collaborative and really simple. And so I took this idea, and we were literally just students at the time, so um, took this idea and applied it to the niche market of school yearbooks. And me and my co-founder Cliff um, started it, just getting the product built and actually you know, hired a software development company and it sort of kicked us started from there. That was about eight years ago now, so it's been quite a long time in the making. So we were literally working out of my mom's living room and we ended up with printing presses physically in my mom's living room as well. We ended up with five staff in my mom's living room and we had trucks delivering big pallets of paper in my mom's living room. It was kind of comical um, just how much was going on in, and like we were trying to present this really professional image to the world. We had hundreds of yearbook schools around, the, um, around Australia using our product and we were literally in my mom's living room for the first three years of our company. And um, we were working around the clock just trying to build this thing. So our first company is called Fusion Books. That's actually still going really well down the street. Um, that uh, launched in France, New Zealand, and the France licensees actually have come to run Fusion Books Global, and they're doing an amazing job now. Um, but we always knew that that technology was much more powerful than just the yearbook market. 